children to, uh, to go through the process of, of changing their gender uh, gender medically man you know what i'm saying taking those med- uh, those medications to, to you know those different hormones and such man you know he said it was sin what does the scripture say man the scripture say what are you that call evil good and good evil man you see this esau is pushing forth man and we see that he's pushing forth and trying to do away with the uh, ways of yahweh man as the scripture say in judge i mean uh job 9 and 24 he covered the faces of the judge uh, of the judges man you see so he's trying to do away with righteous righteous judgment man and bring forth his own uh his own uh philosophies and ideas man and what he deems is right and what's good when really it's wickedness man you see but uh we're gonna get into it real quick we're gonna write this revelations man revelation 13 and uh 14 it say and deceiver uh, uh, this is verse uh, verse twelve. Is that and he exercises all the power of the first beast before him. It's uh, verse nine. It says, "If any man have an ear, let him hear. He that leadeth into captivity." Shall go into captivity. Hey, any man have a hear? Uh, any man who have an ear, let him hear. And we know everybody got ears. Okay, this is talking about spiritual ears, man. You know, because everybody don't have uh, spiritual eyes and ears to understand these scriptures and understand the judgment that the Lord is going to, uh, 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 you know, bring forth on the Edomites, man. You know, he that killed him with the sword. And he that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity, man. All right. And who who put you so called Negro, Latinos, and Native Americans into captivity, man? Well, Esau, Edom, the rest of the nation had their hand in it as well, man. You see, so all the nations that are not of the nation of Israel are going into captivity, man. It does say the scriptures, man. Okay, it tells you that in the book of Jeremiah, all that devoured thee shall be devoured, and all that uh, took thee captive, well, he did for captive. Rough paraphrase, man. You see, he that killeth with the sword, he that killeth with the sword, must be killed with the sword. Must be killed with the sword. That's righteous judgment, man. You see. And how was I told Peter the same thing, man? You know, put up your sword until it's sleep. Uh, he that take up the sword shall die by it, man. You see, so it's this blessing that the uh, Yahweh Bashi Man was shot, okay, uh, gave unto Esau Edom, man, was really a curse, man. You see, the most I got your, uh, uh, Esau in the trick bag, man. You know, and Esau has been ruling by the, and that's how you can tell who, who the Edomites are in these end times, man, because according to the prophecy, the Edomites will be ruling in the end times, man. Second Ezra chapter six, man, okay. Various other scriptures, man. Uh, what is that? Psalm 37. Oh, daughter of Edom, who ought to, I mean, uh, oh, daughter of Babylon, who ought to be destroyed. Okay. Right before that, it says, What? Remember the children of Edom, man. Lincoln Edom, Edom unto uh, 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 Babylon, man. Okay. And also, it's another one that talks about uh, uh, Edom shall be a desolation, and Egypt shall be a desolation, and Edom shall be a, a, a desolate wilderness. Roughly paraphrasing, man. And we know that we in the spiritual Egypt, man. Okay. Those are two scriptures that you can use to tie Esau. Uh, the so-called white man until ruling in his end times, man. You know, Jeremiah 49, Jeremiah 50, I believe 51 is the said it's been at the place. 
he uh here here is the patience and the faith of the saints. Yeah, that's that's what we waiting for. That's our patience, man. That's what we suffering. What we suffering right now, man. That's why we that's why we holding ourselves back from, from being carnal because we want this. You see, we know that if we take matters in our own hand, we can't win. But if we have patience and wait on the Lord, like the scriptures say, wait till I rise up unto the prey. If we have patience and wait on the Lord, then we're gonna get to really get our lick back, man. In righteousness, man. You see, and then it ain't gonna, it ain't nothing this devil gonna be able to do. Okay. You going, bro? Oh, and this, oh, you can link that uh, uh, Esau, Edom. Okay, and it's a, this Revelation 13 in a, in a book of Daniel, man. But when you read up in Revelation 13, man, it talks about that beast being a leopard, man. Okay. When you read the book of Daniels, man, it tells you that the, that the leper was the Greeks, man. Okay, who prides themselves on being Greeks? Well, the so-called white man. Okay. Uh, Revelation 13 and 11. And I beheld another beast coming up out of the earth. And he had two horns like a lamb. And he spake as a dragon. Yeah, this is and this is the other beast that came up out of the earth, man. The revival of the Roman Empire, man. Okay. And it says he had two horns like a lamb. When she come, he's coming uh, all humble, like he had, like he's like he's for you. That's why you have the Demo uh, now you have the uh, what? Yeah, the Democrats and the Republicans. Back then you had the, uh, the Flavians and the Patricians, man. Okay, those different parties that were set up to give you people a false sense of you have a choice, man. Okay, to give you that sense that you had a choice, but really you don't have a goddamn choice, man. Okay, everybody knows that these elections are rigged. Okay. That these different presidents, you ain't voting them in. They're, they're already decided before they even before they even come up to the terms, man. Right. You see? Keep going, bro. Right. Uh, that that show Key and Peel, you know, which we know, like they told us that in school, but they they uh, made a joke about it, talking about uh, uh, those electoral votes and those tutorial votes. The mass of the people, that's just like a suggestion. They're going to basically want to weigh the odds on who you want to be in the be in uh, uh, office. So they basically you just telling them what you want, what you want, but it's up to these uh, elites to determine who's gonna be there. That's like you got your little brother, you playing the game. He said you playing the game. He wanna play it, and you give him the controller that's not pulled up. You know what I'm saying? To give him that the, 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 the mindset. Right. Oh, I'm playing too, but really he ain't playing. Right. right. You know, that's basically what he, that's basically what Esau is doing with the uh, masses of the people, man. Mm -hmm. Giving that giving that false sense of oh, you have a choice. Right. You have rights. Well, you ain't got no damn rights, man. It's yeah. good to see that Esau is taking the he's he's doing away with the Constitution as we speak, man. Right. That's why you got various brothers' videos getting getting taken down, and, it, and it's only our videos, man. Right. Here it is. You have these other uh, 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 other dudes, man, who's bringing out the uh, the scriptures say that Esau's tongue is gonna fall upon himself. Yeah. These other Edomites who's calling the, the, their own nation now, but they they they, they videos get <laughs> they niggas be going in, bro, right. and they videos are up. But he's taking right. ours down. Why? Because we're linking it to the scriptures, man. Right. You see? We we calling this nigga out like the scriptures say, man. The Lord said he can make Esau bear, man. He shall not be able to hide himself. And he said his prophets up to, to make this nigga to, <laughs> to make this nigga bear, man. Right. See, to expose Esau, man. To expose the devil, man, and Satan. Okay? Esau taking the videos down because he know that coming out the scriptures will bring hope to Israel. Yeah. You don't want no kind of hope. That's why he killed like Michael Beck's all up, they didn't bring hope. Right. He don't want that. Yeah. You know, you bring a hotel to Jake. That's it. They know when we're down, they're up. You know, when, whenever the nation of Israel starts to come up, you know, to get that hope, then yep. they know they're about to go down, man. You know, and that's that spirit, man. You know, like it says in Revelation, the 11th chapter, man, they see us standing on, on our feet and giving that breath. You know, now that spirit is upon them, man, because they know what that means, what that stands for. That's in the, that's in the scriptures. Uh, what is that Judith, the sixth chapter, you know, when they had, uh, I think he was a Moabite or Ammonite. Well, he was pretty, yeah. Yeah. chapter, okay, yeah. So, you know, pretty much he had, uh, I think, a servant or something come up to him telling them, like, look, these people, you know, they, they gotta be with them. But if you do something to make them go up, yeah. you know what I'm saying, then, then we can overtake them. You know what I'm saying? And that's what he saw already. He saw the elites of, of the Edomites already know. They've been knowing that, you know. So they they do everything that they can. They implement everything that they can in this world to make us go up. What was that one thing that uh oh that they that that that, that, that the chemtrails got uh yeasty. So it's yeah. pretty much impossible to keep the Sabbath breathing. You know, it's every, breathing it in. You know what I mean? So. Esau, Esau does everything in his power to, to make us go up. 
know, but that's why we talk about the mercy of the, you know, the mercies of the Lord and how it shine, you know. But I got that. I got that. Jude. Oh yeah, yeah. Jude, you got it. All right, this Jude chapter chapter five, Jude chapter five and verse eighteen. Uh, Slocky, my bad. Verse twenty. It says, "Now therefore, my Lord and Governor, if there be any error against His people, if they sin against their God, let let us consider that this shall be their ruin." Yeah, and it goes into the curses. You know, Deuteronomy twenty-eight. No, if, if thou shalt not follow after the ways of the Lord, then these curses shall fall upon thee. No, that's, that's a part of it. You know, hey, uh, your, your enemy, you know, your enemy come up to you and he'll make you flee seven ways. You know? It says, uh, it says, if there be any error against his people and they sin against their God, let us consider that this shall be their ruin and let us go up and we shall overcome them. But if there be no iniquity in their nation, let my Lord now pass by, lest their Lord defend them, and their God be for them, and we become a reproach for all the world. So if they, if they, if the most high was with us, if we went, if we good, you know, we're not going off, you know what I'm saying, then, then the most high is going to fight for us. And they understood that. You know, so he said, like, look, that's just, you know, Lord, if their God is with them, you know, the best thing to do is just walk, just keep on, keep on walking. Yep, you will lose. <laughs> yeah, straight up. Don't, don't even look that way, you know. Hey, and now, like the scripture say, now all the, now all these heathen nations, like it says in Psalms 83, they confederate. Okay, they all came together, man. Or well, they in agreement, okay, to try to cut us off. And like, the, like the, uh, Kahan said, man, Esau does his thing, put these, he, he, he uh, puts pork in every goddamn thing, man. You know, then he'll call it by another name. You know, yeah, you know what I'm saying. And Jake, no, and Jake ain't gonna take the time to look it up. You know, so uh, 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 really, a, a 30 minute grocery store run turns out to be over really about an hour, man. Because we got to go through. You know what I'm saying? And damn, let me check, make sure it ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? This and that. You know what I'm saying? Right. No damn pork in it, man. You know, he does it. And pork in your damn two bus bristles and a fucking toothpaste. You know. All this, man. You know, this is it, it was for design. Why to keep us going off? To keep us disconnected uh, from our power, man. And it's real. And it's real. Cut off. Is what Esau trying to uh, bring forth is that MOTB, man. That RFID. It's like yeah, the MOTB, man. That Karaka. That, that 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 implant, man. Okay. Which the brother is in the same chapter that the brother is reading in Revelation 13, man. All right. Uh, Revelation 13 and 12. And he exercised all the power of the first beat before him. Yeah, the first beat, the ancient Roman Empire, man. That's why when you look at America, America is basically Rome all over again, man. Okay, the malls, the coliseums, okay, heated floors, uh, 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 gymnasiums, man, uh, fucking uh, gyms where people go work at. That's the work for a Roman Empire, man. You see, this is all the, the uh, like we're talking about the, uh, uh, what is that, the damn, uh, the, 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 the the Confederates and uh, not Confederates, but the, uh, yeah, the Democrats and Republicans, all that. It's all over again, man. You see, he's exercising that same, that same authority as that first piece, man. Okay, because you got to remember, oh, go ahead, I got you remember the, uh, the nation was used to be a uh, what they call like a monarch where a king's son was taken. Yeah. There would be a line where a king's son would, you know, they would continue to rule, man. And uh, that's what I'm saying, Daniel, this was diverse from all those other kings, man. You see why? Because now it's voted in, man. When you read the book of Maccabees, it talks about that, man. It talks about them, uh, basically their government, man. Okay, I'm what they call it, bro. Let's put my name on Like, not the Congress, but the Senate. Yeah, the Senate, man. Yeah, yeah, exactly, the Senate, man. You see? No, you can say what you say. You say uh, I was, the thing you said about Daniel about the fourth beast being diverse, that's that's what I was gonna exactly what I was gonna say. You know what I'm saying? Because the manner of rulership that, that the Roman Empire set up, you know, that's why the scriptures talk about it being diverse. You know, so you, you, know, you pretty much said everything you know uh, that I was gonna say. Yeah, that's how, that's another way you can link the Roman Empire. Uh, America like it's the same way as, as the Roman Empire. Man, even, even the Constitution is, is fashioned after the, uh, after the uh, Roman Constitution, man. You see? Bro, all this is wrong 2.0 from the, from the building structures, man. Everything, bro. It's clear to see, man. But like the brother read earlier, hey, him who have ears to hear and eyes to see, basically, man. He did uh, uh, reverse 9 again. It's all right now. This is uh, 
verse 9, Revelation 13 and 9, if any man have an ear, let him hear. You see, if any man have an ear, like the elder said, are you going to say something about the understanding? I don't want to hear me to understand, to perceive. Yep. See, like the elder said, hearing me basically to, like I said, to understand and perceive, man. To have to have the understanding of, to see that what we, what these scriptures, what we said is, is exactly what these scriptures are talking about, man. Right. You know? If I could add to, just, just to add to, to you know, things that, that, that prove that this place is wrong, they signed something known as the Treaty of Rome. You know what I'm saying? Also, when you in, in their in their uh, 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 school curriculum, you have to learn Roman numerals. That's why, like when we watch the Super Bowl, it's in Roman numerals. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Just like the Kahan said, the 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 uh, uh, the uh, what is it? Uh, the building, building, the building the structure. structure. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you know, structure. Yeah. 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 That's that's the word I was looking for. That Ar arch architect, architect architecture. Yeah. The architecture is based after Rome. You look up in Washington, D.C., that's all you see. Hell, these buildings right here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's that, that's Roman ar ar uh, uh, architecture, man. You know what I'm saying? So this is Rome 2.0 all, all, all over again. And the scriptures say in Ecclesiastes, the third chapter, that which was then is now, man. You know what I'm saying? There's no new thing under the sun. It's that which, uh, uh, in, in, in the first chapter, the thing that has been is that which, uh, which, uh, uh, yeah, you can grab it real quick. I don't want to jack it up. You know, and that which is done shall be done. And that which shall be done, man. There's no new man under the sun. Matter of fact, you get that, I'm going to get the. It's Ecclesiastes chapter 1 and verse 9 in the NLT. It says, History uh, merely repeats itself. It has been done, but uh, it has all been done before. Nothing under the sun is truly new. That's right. See? That's right. I was going to say, uh, if you look up pictures on Google of Mount Seir, it, it look it, it looks like the entrance of the of a, of a, of a, of a courthouse, man. Yep, yep, yep. You know, that's the same thing. Making them up. Yes. The, cliff, the, the man that there was in the cliffs of the rocks, that's Esau, man. That's right. Like the, the manner and the, the way he thinks, the spirit, it all it's all back back here, man. You know the the way he wants things. You know what I'm saying? Like putting up buildings. Uh, 50, 60 stories high, you know, it, 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 something inside of him is like, man, you know, I'm going to have my penthouse up here, you know, I'm going to be over all these, you know what I'm saying? That's how, that's how he is, you know? Fast food, fast food goes back to ancient world, man. You see, hey, bro, we can go on and on, man, you know? Yeah, the Rome at first was called Edom Rome, you know? Yeah. They tried to put that disguise so they took off Edom. Just call it, call it Rome. And if I'm not mistaken, Washington D.C. What they named? What did Rome? Yeah, it was named Rome. Yeah, yeah. So, hey, man, no new thing under the sun. And I was, I really, I want you to read that. Can you read it in the in the, in the KJV? I wanted to link, make, you know, this Ecclesiastes chapter one in verse nine in the KJV. It says, "The thing that had been, it is, uh, it is that which shall be, and that which is done is that which shall be done." And there is no uh there is no new thing under the sun so these people are back this is uh, ecclesiastes 6 and 10. that which hath been which is what the the kahan just read is named already and it is known that it is man so it's talking about men the, a, a man that has been he's going to be again and whatever he did he's going to do it again that's what that's saying when you link the, the the scriptures together you know here a little bit there a little bit like it says in isaiah 28 10. you know what i'm saying Precept must be upon precept, precept upon precept, line upon line, line upon line, here a little, there a little. And that's how the puzzle gets put together. And the scriptures also say that uh, uh, how the uh, uh, things of Esau sought out, man, you know, by way of this knowledge, man, you know, the, the Holy Spirit. You know, so the, these men that you look at as just uh, uh, nothing lowly, you know, ain't about nothing. Hey, these men have the knowledge, man, through the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. That's how Esau has been uh, 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 brought out in these times and who he is. You know, that elephant in the room being pointed out in these times, man. You know? That's why that's, that's why a Christian ain't going to be uh, be able to break that, uh, break that down in Revelation. Or, uh, that, you know, he must be loose for a little time. Who is that talking about? Little Caesar? Like, who is that talking about? Like, you're talking about like the Lord put Satan in the jail. You know what I'm saying? Right. No. You know what I mean? Like it's talking about a man. Yeah, That's right. why it says in Isaiah 14, is this the man that right. made the, the world to tremble? Right. Yeah. You right. know, like this guy right here, like, like people are gonna really look at this dude and be like, damn, like, 
we, we really thought this guy was something, but right. it was just a, what, what was that? A wizard, wizard of Oz scene? Yeah, that little nigga yeah. behind the curtain. Yeah, that was, uh, yeah. Right. That's Esau, man. Right. Right. Yeah. I mean, that I'm working. I have to work for safety. Yeah, like Revelation 13, verse 12. And he exercised all the power of the first beast before him and caused the earth and them which dwell therein to worship the first beast whose deadly wound was healed. There you go. That's what we're talking about. You know, he made them to worship the first beast, which was the Roman Empire. You know? You know what I'm saying? And, and, and it said, I'll read that first verse again so I can. Go ahead. It says, he exercises all the power of the first beast before him. Yeah, he exercised the first power, of, the power of the first beast before him. And everything that, 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 that Esau is doing here in America is the same thing that he was doing back in the Roman Empire. You know, when it comes to the laws, statutes, you know what I'm saying? The, the, the way that the regions would be ruled, the governors, you know what I'm saying? Mayors, whatever. And then as well as, as dealing with the other nations, man. The, the, the way America has the, the embassies and then going in and declaring democracy and freedom. Bro, the Roman Empire was doing the same thing, man. You had, you know, back then you, hey, right now you, what, what, what do you see, saw call them? Uh, insurgents? Well, hey, hey, the Roman Empire called them uh, barbarians back then. Same thing, man. But, hey. Then barbarians, you know, you think of the word barbarian, the name barbarian, you think all oh, these people don't, you know, they're uh, not civilized. No, these motherfuckers had weapons that rivaled the Roman Empire. Yep. You know, to the to where what? Eventually, they were taken out by the, by the, by by these barbarians. Yep. And like like the brother going into man, history repeats itself. So them same same barbarians is going to do the same thing to this place. You know? Yeah. Reincarnation, man. Everything is reincarnated, man. The scriptures, con the, the reincarnation is all throughout the scriptures, man. You know, seasons are reincarnated. You just look at the earth. Seasons are reincarnated, man. Kingdoms are reincarnated. Revelation 11, man. Spiritually, Sodom and Egypt, man. Okay, it's reincarnated, man. It's okay. snowing in Rome. It's snow here. Yeah, right. You know, yeah, back then too. Yeah, like God like, like, you know said, man. See, right, man, of course, man, but that, you know, just quick, you know, I wanted to break that out, you know, these people are not dumb, man, you know. Let's talk about the boys with the wheels. Hey, man, hey, and that's the modern day motherfucker's call with the pipes on it, man. You know? But, uh, you want to say something? No. Revelation 13 and 13. And he do a great wonder, so that he make a fire come down from heaven and the earth in the sight of men. Yeah, during the time of uh, what was the first boat? Kosovo. Kosovo. Yep, yep. That was the first time they would, uh, you know, bomb somebody, man. See? Yeah. That was the first, hey, even uh, you, you can use, uh, you know, uh, yeah, not the yep. You yep. yep. see, man. Yeah, you know? I'll break out to this one. Let's go into that second. You see? Just the man. You know what I'm saying? That was yeah. a miracle. That was miracles, man. He was the first thing that, that, that was. Well, that was the first time that shit like that was seen on the planet Earth, man. Yeah, so everybody cool. was, yeah, everybody said, oh, man, it's, oh, shit, man. Yeah, it must be God. And that's, yeah, that's set that yeah. fear. I was going to say, yeah, set yeah. that fear in the planet. Yeah. Right. He saw what saw you saying in the movies, too, man. When it comes to these war movies, uh, uh, what was that one with Tom Cruise? He didn't look like Tom Cruise, but, he, like, you know, he, 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 Tom Cruise was playing like a broke fat. Oh, what was nah, it that nah. one? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Tropic yeah, Thunder, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Tom Cruise yeah. is talking on the phone. He's like, man, can you see the phone? Man? Yeah. So, uh, they started, like, going off on it. It's like, I will rain fire, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, he was talking yeah. about the, the missiles, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, that, that's, the, that's that fire from, the falling from heaven, man. That's right. You know, so Esau has the, the power the power to do that, you know what I'm saying, which seems like a miracle, you know? But, you know, it's just something that he, uh, he you know, that he created. You know, it's nothing like you know, like the Lord. You know, the Lord can do you know miracles, but you know, that's why people likened it unto a miracle. Because it seemed like, damn, this dude, like you know, you see that miss missile coming down. You know what I'm saying? And then it hits the earth, and it you know fire. You know, you got napalms that never been seen. You know, that's that's why they saw it as a miracle. They had never seen it. You know what I'm saying? So you know, and they're like, like, wow, what the hell is this? You know. You know? Uh, what's, what's that one? Uh, what's that one thing that Russia used recently? Uh, white phosphorus. 
Oh, oh yeah, yeah, it's like, like uh, uh, lights or something like yeah, the like embers the, coming down. Yeah, like embers coming, like it looks like little Crazy. like white flames coming down from the, you know, it's, and it's not in the falling fast. It's just like this, like oh, you know, slowly they, falling. They you burn know? through like, if I'm not mistaken, like hard type of metal. It can yeah. burn through. Yeah, I'll go, yeah, I'll go, I'll go through a house. Mm-hmm. I'll, I'll, I'll catch a whole house on fire. And the scriptures talk about it too. Like, what is that? Isaiah 14, it's just a man that did shake kingdoms. Yeah. You know? Hey, weird what, man? It turned it, basically make it a desolation, but through his, through his missiles, man. It's different military weapons, man. You see? Revelation 13 and 14. Uh, and deceive us them that dwell on the earth. By the means of those miracles. Yeah, deceive them, man. Okay? By those miracles. Uh, uh, real quick, somebody get that Thessalonians, Second Thessalonians, bro. It talks about those lying wonders, man. And get that definition of uh, 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 lying. You know what I'm saying? Real quick. You know? Because that's what we're getting ready to see, man. He saw us getting ready to, he's he, he's getting ready to deceive, like, uh, deceive the masses, man. Okay? He's talking about uh, uh, the mothership. No, uh, it's a mothership. Uh, 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 you yeah. know? They sending out probes. You know, because right. Esau, why? Because he knows that Yahweh Shah is getting ready to come back, man. That's right. Okay. Esau, hey, these top elite banking families know the prophecies, man. Yeah, That's why they're doing everything to fight against it. You see? You know, uh, including putting out uh, this, this false this uh, false representation of the chariots, man. Mm-hmm. Saying that they're, they're, they're little green, man. They're grays. Right. They're the Ananaki. Right. They're fallen angels. Right. No, man. Why? Because he's getting ready to have you people. Especially you so-called Negro Latinos and Native Americans, he's about to have you fight against your own God, man. Right. You see? Oh, oh you that? got that? Oh, oh, go ahead. Uh, I was just gonna say, what's that movie? Uh, it's about aliens, but it's called the Seventh, the Seventh Trumpet or Seventh, Seventh Sound or something like that. But the main character is that girl from uh, Kick, uh, Kick Ass. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, oh, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. There was a movie. Yeah. yeah, there was a movie about you know aliens invading Earth. Yeah, it took over the military. Yeah, 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 yeah it took yeah, over yeah. the military. So the military has set up like like helmets you, that you had to wear, so you could see who who was an alien and who was not. You know what I'm saying? So they said don't ever, don't ever take off your helmet because you know the air or whatever it might it might contaminate you. So now now every time you look at any human, it looks like a you know I say oh that's an alien. But then, truth be told, you take off that helmet, and then you know what I'm saying this. That you know, like if I'm looking at you and you take off your helmet, like you know, you're not alien. So the, so the military was using the helmets to pretty much trick people into thinking that that the aliens were everywhere. It was all it was just all a lie. This is uh, Psalm 73 and 28. It say, "As a dream will one awake up, so O Lord." When thou awakest, thou shalt despise their image. Hey, and like I said, now we, we're awakening and we're, like I said, we're despising their image. We despise the, the beast, like you're saying, with them helmets. You can see, see who, was, uh, who was the alien and who was not. You know, that's why we're, we, uh, the son of perdition is revealed and we're actually concealed through the, through the, through the lenses of the Lord. Uh, yeah, this is a Second Thessalonians chapter two. I'm yeah, yeah. starting verse seven. It says, "For the mystery of iniquity doth already work; only he who now letteth will let until he be taken out of the way." Now, what is Paul talking about when he said that, man? The mystery of iniquity doth already work. Well, the Edomites were already in rulership, man. The ancient Roman Empire, man. Okay, this is going into that man of sin that is talking about. When you read more, when you read up, uh, up, up, up in the chapter, man, who says he's gonna, these are characteristics, saying he's gonna oppose and exalt himself over everything that is called God, man. Now, who, by process of elimination, who is doing that on the planet Earth, man? Okay, who's the top nation that, that's in that mindset, man? Esau, the so called white man, the biblical Edomites, man. Okay, when you, if I can add, when you Google, this nigga has put himself at the, at the face of the Lord, man. If you Google anything in the Bible, it's going to come up a so-called self-proclaimed white man, a so-called white man. You Google the Most High God himself, and you will see a so-called white man when the Bible describes these people, these entities and people as, so, as so-called blacks. You know, dark skin, you know what I'm saying? Woolly hair, you know? So he changed, he, like, like the scriptures say in Job, he covered the faces of the judges, man. You know what I'm saying? 
by changing those images. I think when you read it, uh, what the second Maccabees or the first Maccabees? Yeah, yeah. The third chapter, uh, the third, third chapter, uh, 48, 48. Yeah, it says that they went into the book of the law, which is the Bible, and they sought to, uh, to paint the likeness of their images, man. You know what I'm saying? The heathen, right? You know, so they're false images. And that's why, like, they, they have this, uh, uh, such uh, like what, what Russian icons, yeah. Russian icons, uh, iconoclasm. You can you can find go into all these things, and you'll see the actual true images, man. Right. You know. Hey, and people will say, well, why, why, you know, it doesn't matter. Well, if it didn't matter, then why did the Lord put it in the scriptures, man? Right. Exactly. Right. Why did they, they change? It? Why did they change it? Exactly. Exactly, man. If the if the way the Lord, the color of the Lord didn't matter, then why then, then why is it in the scripture, man? Right. No, Obviously, no, 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 no. I was gonna say, man, you know damn well deep down it it does matter to them because if they if if, 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 if yeah. let's say the history was to where everybody knew that God was a, a so-called black man, you know what I'm saying? Then they would feel a certain type of way. Right. about those people that look like that. Yeah. Right. You know, so man, stop with that bullshit. Like, oh, it don't matter. I don't see. Good. Man, you know damn well if you know they, uh, uh, hey, you saw it come out in the news like uh, Jesus Christ was a black. You know what I'm saying? Like people would be like, that's bullshit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like you know they, 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 bro, These people have problems when when they do a movie. You know, oh, yeah. and, and, and and Little Mermaid. Yeah. They made the yeah. Little Mermaid that ain't even real. Black and they, these people had a connection, man. When they did, what was it? Oh, the Batman. Uh, oh, the Batman. Uh, when they made the Gordon. These are all of Gordon. Mr. Gordon. Gordon. Yeah, yeah. yeah, Bro, yeah, had them. The Edomites were bad guys. And these are all the, the Jakes were good guys. All yeah. the black people were good guys. They had connections, man. <laughs> yeah. So they lined their ass off like the, like the brother said, going into, man. They, they care, man. Oh, video games with uh Jacks on Mortal oh, Kombat. Yes. You know, you win the game. They didn't say nothing about nobody else winning the game, but what he saw he did. Right. He basically did, uh called slavery, I think, not to happen or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And they was upset about that. They were like, We're supposed to keep them in captivity. Right. What are you talking about? But they're on video game. Right. That show you the hate for this, the hate right. they have for you. That's right. Yeah, Lord showing his hate you have towards they punk okay. ass. That's right. That's why we out here now. Fuck surprise. Hey, well, real another another quick point, man. Like it says, he's opposing and exalted himself, man. Like the Han uh, brought, um, you know, just quoted Job nine and twenty four about covering up the faces of the judges, man. Okay, because he saw look 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 at what America pushes for. This is supposed to be a so called country that was founded on uh, Bible principles, but look look how it was founded, man. It tells you what have a coop, man. Woe to him that built a uh, town out of blood, man. Right. Okay, and woe means destruction, man. Okay, we know America. You know, it was founded off wickedness, man. Great robbery and murder, man. Okay, look at the laws that he's pushing forth now with this alphabet gang shit, man. Okay, I thought this place was supposed to be a representation of, of, of God. Right. You know, I thought this place was supposed to follow follow the Lord, man. Right. Right. See, but look what they're pushing forth, man. He's opposing himself. He's he's opposing himself, man. He's against everything that the Lord stands for. That's why it says in Revelation, he's blaspheming the the uh, uh, by Shimei Oshai, or the name, okay, the tabernacle, and them that dwell in heaven, man. Like the Han said, he'll tell you that the, look, the angels are white, everybody white, you know. Like like Muhammad Ali said that one time. He asked his mom when he was younger, why is everything white good? <laughs> right, you know, yeah, white, yeah. you know, black male, that's something bad. Right. The white cake is the angel cake. Yeah. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? The devil food cake is the chocolate, chocolate, chocolate yeah. cake, man. You see? But then, hey, this all, it's a, it's a psychological yeah. thing, man. Yeah. You got to understand who you're dealing with, man. You see? And that image that Esau pushes forth the, of, 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 of Jesus Christ being the son of the heavenly father as a so-called white man, that has an effect on people, man. Exactly. That has an effect. And it's been this been pushed on our people for hundreds of years, man. Exactly. That's why our people have that Stockholm syndrome towards the so-called white man. They'll, they'll forget this goddamn devil for anything, man. Right. But when it comes to a, a person that looks like them, they'll be ready to shoot them down, man. They want revenge, you see. The heavenly father, hey, okay, man. That's why it says in Ecclesiastes, man, the, hey, the heavenly father requires that which is past, man. Right. This nigga ain't getting away with nothing, man. And all, all these things still back to that social construct, man. You know what I'm saying? Black and white, which neither color exists in people, man. Right. You know what I'm right. saying? You got red and brown, man. Not black and white, but but again, like the like the Han went into, those things have an effect. You know what I'm saying? And when, when you say white, you know, that's that's likened to cleanliness pure purity when you go into black those terms it's the total opposite dark you know darkness wickedness evil you know dirty nasty you know just 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 the total opposite man 
You know what I'm saying? So when those labels got placed on the people, that's how this nigga, like the scriptures say, that Satan has transformed himself into an angel of light, man. Yep. That's why nobody ever looked at this nigga. They looked at him as, oh, he's white. These are God's people. They're pure. They're clean. They won't hurt anyone. They won't touch a fly. And when this nigga killing everything on the planet, man, in, in, in droves and in, in large numbers, you know, genocide, you know. That's a fucking movie. Don't be a menace when they went into the store, man. That's a perfect example. Boy, I'm watching Jake whole time. He saw robbing their ass blind, man. Exactly. Hey, 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 hey. You dropped something. Yeah. Nigga had a bag and everything in his fucking head, man. Bro. And that and those type of movies prove it. Prove exactly that, man. You know what I'm saying? That social construct, man, that was some man. That nigga did his thing, man. You know, this nigga is a, is a demon, man. He put a number on the people. He did a number on the people, bro. To my cash in the court. Right. Those covering cash? Yeah. Yeah. I said I said 20 uh Cash cover 20, 25 or seven. No, it wasn't. Uh, uh, oh, it's another. Oh, come, come, come. Yeah. Mama on uh, good time, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Michael yeah. painted that yeah. picture. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I don't care. This is this is uh, the Jesus I know. Right. And this is that. Yeah, and he, uh, hey, he was uh, uh, oh, oh, it's it's a white man. Yeah. Yeah. Right yeah. Yeah. You know, she said that's the one I know. So he brought out the scripture. Like in that time, the, like the going to the 60s and 70s, they would do those different, they would uh, make that as coming, you know? They did that with Fred Sumpter, talking about he was, you know, in this uh, TV show, talking about he was a, uh, uh, I, uh, I can't think of his name. Yes, to say, well, if I know my Bible, you, your, your, uh, your forefathers was uh, uh, basically a, a Jew. Or a small, I've been I've been yeah, and he, he up there like he having a heart attack. But see, now they can't go and bring out these types of jokes to try to make it seem like it's funny. Because right. now Jake knows it's, that, hey, it's truth too. Yep. On yep. the council culture, no. Yep. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back in Second Thessalonians 2 and verse 7, it says, For the mystery of iniquity already worked. That's like that's only he who now let it will let until he be taken out of the way. Hey, that's your how about Shimei was shot, man. The Lord is allowing this nigga, man, to, to, to do what he's doing, man. Okay? Because like you said, until, hey, now he's in the time of revealing, man. Okay? To that man of sin be revealed, we in that time, man. Because the Lord had allowed him, like brothers are going into, for a long time, Esau had the power to deceive. He had that left-hand magic to deceive the people. So every word that came out this nigga's mouth, everybody believed. 9-11 was a perfect example, you know? This nigga had that day, hey, that, and that was the last good, uh, 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 you know, really uh, deception that that nigga really was able to bring forth to have everybody believe. Ever since then, his power has been going down, man. That See, you don't away. have that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah he, uh, that's pale, that's, that's paved away. Yeah, yeah, yeah he, he, does, he doesn't have that same power as he used to, man. Yeah. Why? Because another another reason, because these phones, man, you know, information, the internet, yeah. you know, that rocks out. I think you said this up, man. That was the, that was the worst thing they created, man. Yep. And really, it was the, the Lord put the spirit <laughs> on exactly. them to do that, man, to bring forth the internet, man. You see? Second Thessalonians 2 and 8. And then shall that wicked be revealed, whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. It says, and then shall that, that wicked be revealed, right? Man. Okay? Because the scriptures tell you in Malachi 1, 1 and 4 uh, that, that Esau Edom is the wicked, man. Okay? We know our people, we know it's wicked people in the world. We know our people are wicked, but the wicked that this is talking about right, is going into a nation, man. Right. Okay. The, the, the biblical Edomites, man. Okay. Right. right. And it's clear to see by this nigga uh, 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 history that this nigga is the wicked. Exactly. Yeah, I was going to just add to that because, you know, you'll have, especially Jake, because they love to defend Esau because of Stockholm Central. Well, there's wicked in, in, in all nations, but when you deal with words like the and that, Right. It's specific. Yeah. yeah. It's talking about something specific. Yeah. So you can't go to all in every nation there's wicked. Be wicked and that wicked is yeah. something specific. So he's talking about specifically the nation of Esau, Edom, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I can't, you said baffles me, but people don't look at this man, I know he's wicked. I cannot see the white man as a fucking devil, man. Exactly. Y'all think too much of an angel and sword, man. Yeah, that show you how powerful the Lord is, bro. Right. Got a blood, bro. It's clear as day to us, man. Yep. It's clear as day, bro. See, bro. You look at the, even uh, the nation of Israel and these other nations, 
What nation is walking for especially here in America? All these other these other heathen nations. What nation has Esau not came and great robbed, murdered, conquered, you know what I'm saying, or, or did something to basically uh, uh, rough you up? You know, look at all over there, like say with the uh, Iraq. What did he do over there? He came, uh, uh, basically lied, they got weapons of mass destruction, came and destroyed them. And what do you do? He put the embassy up. Now you got these people now saying they was in a better off state, you know, on the stump. You know, Afghanistan. They went over there, uh, uh, basically took all their uh, um, natural resources, took all their opium. That's why you got the uh, uh, opioid uh, 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 epidemic over here. <laughs> and then what do you do? So we leave over there. They rejoice. They say, we can get our, our, our everything back in order. The women started going out. Everybody wanted to follow the Western way. Right. So East, everywhere Esau go, like I say, uh, uh, confusion, death, hell, all this shit followed with, with him coming to try to say he's taking aid to help you out or what have you. And that the boss said he's the arbiter of death. Yep, right. sir. Death followed this man that way he fucking go. Yes. Hey, what's the guy? It's, it's one movie. It's, it's a big ass giant. It's dude. He was coming back. It's like every time, but I forget the name of that. I forget the name of that movie, bro. But everywhere he went, man, she was just dying. Yeah. The tall, giant, metal looking. Forget the name of the movie. No, no, nah, nah, it was about a few years back, some years back. I forget the name of it. Uh, my man played in the, uh, the picture told me, like, uh, uh, he played John Wick. Oh, what was his name? Uh, yeah, Marie, yeah. Yeah. Are you talking about the, the day that the earth still still? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, 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 this is not as coming to us and those that are learning through us, man. You know what I'm saying? This, hey, this nigga is being consumed. Yep. He being pointed out. You know, it, it kind of reminds me of that scene, like in, in The Simpsons, when when, when Homer be starting to slide oh, back in the bush. <laughs> no, we grabbing that nigga and, and pulling yep. him back out the bush and said, no, this nigga right here, man, before he get a chance to, you know, because he set forth darkness, man. He, yep. They're the children of the, of the dark, the children of the night. What's done in the dark? Evil, wickedness. You know what I'm saying? Right. But if, if when you turn the light on, you know what I'm saying? That's like roaches. They start trying to scatter. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, they've been consumed with the spirit of the uh, 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 of the, of the mouth, which is the prophets, man. That's right. So uh, continuing on, it says, uh, "And shall destroy with the brightness of his coming." It's going into the chariots when Yahweh returns, man. So here's the point. It says, "Even him who's coming is after the workings of Satan." Even him. Who's coming is after the working of Satan, man. Like, can you grab that word working real quick, bro? See? This, so basically, it's going to be a man that man of sin, you got to remember. You read in this chapter, it's, just, it's, just, it's describing a man, okay? And his characteristic and what he, what he, what he will be pushing forth, man. Okay? Yeah. Wickedness, you see? Mm -hmm. It says it's coming with, will be after the workings of Satan, man. Okay? Mm -hmm. And the word is G1753, and it's energia. Yep. And it says, uh, Outline of biblical usage working deficiency in the New Testament used only of a super, superhuman power, whether of the most high or of the devil. Oh, yeah. it, says, it says operation, man. Right okay. 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 The strong's def definition. It says operation, strong working, yep. efficiency. Yep. So his operation and what he and what he stands for, man. Okay, energy of his energy will be after the workings of Satan, man. Okay, he operates after the work, uh, work of the same yeah. That's right, you know. He, oh, he say, oh, he has to be. Kind of, it says, and uh, I just read again. Second Thessalonians two and nine. Even him, whose coming is after the working of Satan, with all power and signs and lying wonders. All power, man. Sign with signs and lying wonders, man. You see, what is old? Uh, yeah, you got the word uh, uh, lying. Yep. Yep. Because these miracles that we was reading about, he was going to have powers to do, man. Because right. you got to remember, the Lord blessed Esau too, man. You know? Right. The scriptures say he would be wiser than Daniel, man. The scriptures talk about Babylon and her, and her, and her sorceries, man. You know? Showing that she was, like, this place is going to have power, man. Okay? 
not only just a military man, but hey, he's gonna have power to deceive. Okay, yeah. it was technology, man. He's gonna that's that's what's gonna deceive a lot of people when, that is talking about in Revelation 13, man. Yeah. Okay, because these people gonna see this technology that he's gonna bring forth, and they're gonna see it as salvation. You see, he saw he's going he's getting ready to push that message forth. Like, look, you I can be your salvation. You don't have to wait on God. Okay, you don't have to die. You know, I, I, I can keep you here. When the scriptures tell you that uh, in the book of Ecclesiastes, that no man have the power to retain the spirit. You see, show you that this nigga is lying. You, know, it, you, nigga, you can't keep the spirit here, nigga. You know? So, <laughs> where, where are they, bro? God, this is a, <clears throat> that word, lying is G5579, and it's pseudos. Pseudos, man. Wow. Yeah, it says to lie, a lie. Conscious and intentional falsehood. Falsehood, man. Okay, because he's gonna, like I said, he's gonna bring forth these, these uh, this technology to where he gonna have people who are crippled. He, he gonna get them ability to walk. People who blind. He already doing it now with the uh, making people hear who are deaf and blind. People who are blind now they can see through this technology, man. It's gonna get to the point to where it's gonna be like them, but it's not gonna be true. It's not gonna be a true miracle, man. It's not gonna be true power, man. Because right. the Esau gonna have a walk, but they gonna be all fucked up. They still gonna be fucked up. Right. They ain't gonna be normal and walking like us, man. Right. You see, right. only the Lord on the right hand side, okay, is gonna have the power to do that, man. Right. The Lord is gonna give power to his man to do miracles, man. Just like right. during the time of ancient Egypt, man, when, right. when those when those magicians came up and fought against Aaron and Moses, man. Okay, showing you that hey, man, even back then they had they had. Power on the left hand side too back then, right. man. Yep. Okay, who is the modern day Pharaoh? It tells you in the book of Romans, chapter 9, that Esau is, man. It's right before it talks about Pharaoh, it talks about who it talks about Jacob and Esau. Yep. Okay. Say, oh, daughter of the Chaldeans who ought to be destroyed. You know, because what is that? We're going to like uh those ancient times, those Chaldeans were sorcerers. All right. Those were sorcerers. And then when that uh and, and you gotta think they had an influence over the Roman Empire. You go into the history when they uh basically when the Persians came in on the, the Babylonians, they had those uh sorcerers, those Chaldeans go up into those uh the, those mountains, like in the Asiatic area. Now you gotta think when you go going through time and you get into the time of uh uh who was that uh person? Hey, uh, first uh see. Julius Caesar, Julius, yes. you know what I'm saying? Julius Caesar was that, that general. And you got to think, he was fighting all the way through there. So when he came up there, those Chaldean, those, uh, those Chaldean was up in the Asiatic area where he was basically had his uh, campaign in his battle. And he basically got the influence was, was some of the influence that came off of Rome. You know, but the Rome received. That's why you have some of the uh, different idols and different things that just changed the name, but all of it came from what? From that Babylonian uh, uh, influence. If I can add two real quick, uh, dealing with that uh, uh, that word pseudo, pseudos, going into those falsehoods, you know, dealing with this dude science, man. You know what I'm saying? There, there's such a such thing as a pseudoscience. You know what I'm saying? Which is false science, man. You know what I'm saying? Which all these people <laughs> believe in in this false science, man. So I want to bring this out real quick uh, because the Book of Timothy goes into that this is uh first timothy 6 and verse 20 it says oh timothy keep that which is committed to thy trust which is this knowledge this truth man it says avoiding profane and vain babblings and oppositions of science falsely so-called because it's pseudo it's falsehood it's not real man and the scriptures are telling us that so we don't believe in this dude science man you know but two-thirds of jake they all into it man i'm a I ain't gonna question the, uh, yep. the inoculation or what, what uh, the infusion. Yeah. Yeah. I ain't gonna look up no ingredients of the infusion. I'm just gonna stick out my arm and take the infusion. Yeah. Come on, man. Pseudoscience. Yeah, right. And she probably gone. Yeah. She probably got she probably out of here, man. Yeah. Yeah. Close yeah. 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 to it. I tried to pull her up. I couldn't I couldn't find uh, yeah. 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 I got a little bit more of a definition, bro. Okay, it says uh back in that definition of pseudo. All right, it says, uh, in a broad sense, whatever is not what it seems to be. Right. It says, of, of perverse, deceitful precepts, man. Okay, so basically, like it says, whatever, it, whatever is not, uh, sorry, whatever is not what it seems to be, man. So it's truly not miracle. It's truly not going to be a miracle, man. Right. right. You see. Right. Hey, man. 
we, uh, matter of fact, jump back to this uh, revelation of brother ain't got nothing, man. No. Because like I said, man, we you, you get, we're getting ready to see, uh, 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 you know, Esau's true power, man. Because these, these phones, they, this shit, man, these are, this is right. years behind right. what truly, uh, what Esau truly has, man. I think what they say about 10 or 20 years yeah. behind, you know, the technology that uh, they, 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 Esau truly has, these iPhone 14, all that blue phone. PlayStation 5, nigga, that shit is old technology, man. Right. It's new to us, man. Right. You know? You look, you look the, the examples of the, the tech that Esau, well, I think it's more than 20, 30 years ago. Because if you look at the, what is it, SR 13, I don't know, the Blackbird, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, the Blackbird. Yeah, that shit was, was uh, created in the, in the 40s, I believe. Because it was used during the, the Second World War. You know what I'm saying? But just, just I mean, I might be wrong. It might be the Vietnam War. But either way, Esau had to take, you know, decades, decades, yeah, yeah decades to, to even come up with, with designing that thing, man, to where it's, it's, you know, it works good. And guess what? Esau still uses that same thing to this day. You know? So just imagine the things that Esau has been working in. You know, 50 years ago. Yeah. You know? And like these fucking events, we're going that do, bro. That was back in the fucking 30s yeah. and 20s. Yeah, exactly. like, yeah. yeah man. I just sit back there, man. Yeah. We just want to capitalize and, and corner the market on every goddamn thing, man. What you get, what you see happening on the planet Earth, man, you seeing your aunt, you seeing the devil getting ready to besiege you, man. You go into that word real quick, bro. I'm going to get back to the revelations. You go into that word besiege, man, real quick, bro. Yeah. Yep, I had it. Man, it's the devil, man, that the Bible speaks of, man. The so called right. Negro, Latino, the Native American, to wake up to that fact, man. This man is not your friend, nor these even uh, nations. That's right. So, like I, like I was going into, what you, what you see taking place right now on the planet Earth, man, is this man is getting ready to, like the scriptures say, Revelation 12 and 12, the devil is getting ready to come down with great wrath. Right. Okay, this is that word besiege in the Google definition. It says to crowd around oppressively, to surround and harass. It says, it says to encircle, to hem in. All right, it says to go into the definition of hem in. <laughs> so, like you, man. Right. so like we was going into that word, besiege basically means to encircle or uh, to uh, it's like it. it says to crowd around oppressively. And what you have now, Esau is in the talk of these 15 minute cities. You have these different train derailments, okay? Back to back to back. This this was orchestrated, man. This was planned out, man. Why? Because Esau is making it to where everybody he's going to push everybody into a pop one populated area. That way, these camera he can keep a, a watch on every damn body, man. Okay, with these different uh, train derailments and these chemicals being spilled in the water, you have people people complaining about the water. The animals are dying. Well, it's going it's going to get to a point where Esau is going to bring the government in and basically tell them, hey, man, this place is unlivable. You need to go to the nearest major city. He's going to push everybody in. That way, what he can have total control, man, and everything is going to be 15 minutes away, okay, from you, wherever you are in the city, everything from the grocery store to the hospital, anything is going to be 15 minutes away. And if you go past that 15 minutes, your ass, your ass grass, unless you got a, uh, uh, what they call it, basically like a pass, man, you see? It's you like, know? It's like if I could make a correction. So the, so the SR-71 is what was called the Blackbird was in the 1960s. It flew, it, the first flight was in the 1960s. You know, so, you know, even before that, it, it took time for them to even develop it, right? Uh, but even when it was retired in 1999, Esau had already a, the, a, the heavy stealth bomber on it, obviously. Man. Yep. You know, and even that, you know, before it was, before it had its first flight, it takes, it takes years, man, for Esau to be able to develop it to where it works good, you know? So, you know, just imagine that, you know, that, you know, the, the, the they were they were they were they were they were calling the SR seventy one old technology, you know. Just imagine that. Yeah, okay. All that shit we be seeing in movies. Damn, oh, nigga, all that time. Oh, that's what Esau be having that shit, bro. Esau ain't man. That shit ain't a lot of that shit ain't fiction, man. That shit for real. Esau putting that shit in movies, man. That's a part of his sorcery, man. He boasts of his heart's desires, man. Yeah. You know. Esau got that that, that fucking camel, that predator, and shit. Esau got some shit, bro. Oh, yeah. He so he got that shit. He can but make a motherfucker like they blending in into the environment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, he, he bring it out in the movie, but you know they already got it. So when it do come about, like the Minority Report, yeah, what the MOT to the V already. 
And, and, and he's saying, you know, that was uh, Women's Minority Report, like in 1999 or something. Yeah, but yet, here it is now that he's better come come forward with that. What is that? Smart city. Smart city. That's what. That's basically what that was. A smart city, though. Mm-hmm. You see. Every what Tom Cruise win, every star, that motherfucker pop it up. Hey, hey, Mr. Hey, Mr. Such and Such. It, it, it knew who he was immediately, yep. man. Why? Because he was tagged. And that's what Esau wants to do, man. Like the brother said, that's a part of his proof, man. Of his false prophecies, man. Yep. He likes to bring for uh bring the past, man. Okay. He wanna link you onto his uh his cloud, man. So where your ass ain't gonna have no control. We we see, bro. This is happening right now, man. Good privacy. See? <laughs> you know? And that and this technology, these people are gonna be. Hey, they already ready for the taking, man. Yep. All these it's gonna, it's gonna take something to cut that food and that water off. And these niggas gonna stick their head. I'm gonna just stick out and take that fuse. You yep. niggas gonna stick out your arm out and take the chip, man. Take you know? that damn fuse, son. Revelation 13, uh, back at 14. Start the top again. It says, and, de- and deceiveth them that dwell on the earth by the means of miracles, of the miracles, it's like of those miracles. Which he had power to do in the sight of the beast, saying to them that dwell on the earth that and that they should make an image of the beast, which had the womb by a sword, and did live. Yeah, that's what we see right now. That image being being made, being, being his uh, policies that he's bringing to pass to do away with certain rights, to bring yeah. forth certain agendas. And it's not only here in America, man. It's all throughout the earth, man. Why? Because Esau controls the rest of his nation, man. He sits upon that beast, man. You see, he has power to put sanction on these different nations, man. I right, yep. stop fucking with them. They, they ain't trying to get in line. Stop fucking with them. Man. You see, why? Because a, a part of that, a part of his power too is, a, is, a, is that dollar, man. You see, but she's gonna get ready to crash to bring forth this new system that we, we, we if we you know, say, Lord, we don't got time to get to it, bro. That it talks about, man. Right. That MOTB, man. All right. It says verse fifteen, and he had power to give life. Until the image of the beast. And how he had power to give life unto the image, man. Through them policies, man. Through these different laws that he's passing, man. Okay, it tells you that, what is that, Daniel 18 and 5, man. Yeah, real quick, man. This is not the first, this is going into, this is going into the, the, the end of this one world government, man. This right. new world order, man. It's not the, the scriptures, are, bro, the new world order is nothing new, man. The brother brought it out early, man. History mere, uh, merely repeats itself, man. You see, there is nothing new under the sun, man. The heathen always try to, Try to get, get that one world uh, uh, order, man. Yeah. Uh, Nimrod, okay. Started, yeah. right. You know, uh, even during the time of uh, 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 Daniel, man. You know, what I'm saying Nebuchadnezzar. Everybody bowed unto the image, man. Right. Everybody got to bow. Then during the time of the Greeks, man. Yep. Now who are the Greeks? They eat the Edomites, man. You see, Antiochus Epiphanes, man. He was the best. That's what what it's talking about in uh, Daniel's eight twenty five, man. You see, but that, that's the Edomite nation, man. You see. Like uh, the dude on uh, uh, on uh, training day when he uh, old boy told uh, Denzel he was like he been planning this all day. He's like he's all, he's like all day I've been planning this all week. Yeah. <laughs> he's been planning this for years and years. That's why you can go back. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's why you can go back and you can see all these different presidents talking about the NWO, right. man. Mm-hmm. Like you said, he been planning this all week. George Bush Sr. said it on live TV. Yep. He was in office. Yep. That nigga said confident. Yes. Confident. <laughs> you know? Yeah, very confident. Yes. Yeah. Certain plans are like a bridge. Whoever started, they may not be living because you know he's all know they gonna, you know, they understand, they understand reincarnation. Reincarnation. Right. They know if they when they start this plan, they may not make it to the end of that bridge. You know, it may take years to build a bridge, so but they know they started, but they want to inherit that what they're gonna finish, what they plan to finish. This is Daniel chapter 8 and verse 25, and it reads, And through his policy, also he shall cause craft to prosper that's in his we, hand. And that's what we see it, man. Why? Because the earth in his hand, because the earth was given to the hands of the wicked. Yep. You see? Power. Yep, that power, man. Okay. The Lord allowing this nigga to do this shit, man. You see. Through these policies, man. Yeah. Why did Esau have these different shit on, on, on the news to get everybody's attention looking one way? On the why why he's sliding policies across that way, he's taking away your rights. Why you looking at some bullshit, man? Yeah. Right, that's you know, hope, that's these fire. different scandals. Or, or, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Esau used these celebrities, man, because 
he know these people love these celebrities. Like even with that nigga with the gun and held up the gun, I'm sure the nigga, uh, what's a nigga, uh, what's a nigga name, bro? That basketball player, oh, bro. Uh, Joe yeah, yeah, man. I'm sure the nigga he's on the slid something across the table, man. While they, everybody's looking at this goddamn basketball, player, you know. Oh, that was yeah. it. Well, no, that's a little more. And when you go into that word, uh, uh crap, it, it goes into a uh, uh, treachery and deceit, man. You know, he gonna cause treachery and deceit to prosper. <laughs> Because it's in the power of this hand to do so, man. Because the, the, the earth has been given it to, to his power, man, to his hand. It says, and he shall magnify himself in his heart, and by peace shall destroy many. Ooh, by peace shall destroy many, man. He going to magnify himself in his heart, man. He going to get proud like the other said, man. That's a part of that nigga characteristics, man. That's how you can That's how you can pinpoint who this nigga is, man. Right. Not you know? Jack, man. Exactly. You know? <laughs> Come on, bro. Yeah, right. And then the scriptures don't say Japheth gonna rule the whole earth, bro. Right, right. Have dominion over the whole earth, bro. Right. That, that was only given up to two two nations of people, man. Exactly. The Edomites and the Israelites, man. Exactly. You see? Oh, it says he shall also stand up against the prince of princes, but he shall be broken without hand. Yep. So are we, are we the last part of the other one, bro? Let's see the second part. Oh, super right. So that goes into that goes into Job the twenty chapter. Peace, yeah. Peace. Nah, this says uh, he shall magnify himself in his heart, and by peace shall destroy many. Man, and by peace shall destroy many. Can we get that in uh, uh, Maccabees? Uh, you know, uh, it's, it's chapter one, bro. What it talks about? Uh, Antiochus basically, oh, basically yeah. sent, the, sent the, uh, uh, basically one of his uh, officers out, man. Cause that's how this devil does, man. It's what you talk about in the book of Psalms. His word, the, the words of his mouth were smoother than butter, but war was in his heart, man. Anytime this devil comes to you with, oh, you know, I care for you. It's a hidden agenda, man. It's an alter, it's an alter, uh, alternate. Uh, how do you say that? It's an uh, alternative. It's a uh, uh, damn. Alternative. Yeah, exactly, yeah. man. Yeah. You know, it's always something. He he has a, a hidden agenda behind it, man. You know. To bring forth what he really wants, man. Mm -hmm. And that's what's going on with, with, with that's what was that's what was going on with, with that juice, man. You know what I'm saying? He acting like he cares about Jake. You know, we we, we want y'all to be first to get it, you know what I'm saying, to come out, you know, you blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans. They always at the forefront of something like that, but they ain't never been, you know what I'm saying, put first for nothing else, man. You know. Sorry, Matter of fact, just get this right to it. Okay, man. This is uh Maccabees one and thirty. And he says, uh and matter of uh, fact, just now matter of fact, that's cool. Okay. Let's jump back this revelation go to one real quick. Revelations 13, and back in uh 15, he says, and he had power to give life and uh life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak. And cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. Hey, and that's the time that we coming into, man. You had you had your boy Big Donald Donald, Donald to the T, man, talking about bringing those uh, uh, bringing those different uh, uh, executions back, man. Right. The guillotine hangings, you know. Now this is the part of prophecy. Why would they be bringing the guillotine back? Right. Mm. Right. Showing you these scriptures the truth. Oh, you got it. Verse it don't cause everybody who don't. Who don't worship this shall be put to death. So everybody gonna be faced with their choice, man. Right. Either you won't follow the way of this this current world, this new system that we setting up, or we gonna kill you, man. You see, yeah, that's yeah. exactly. And he causes all, both small and great, rich and poor, free or bond, to receive a mark, a mark in their right hand or in their forehead. Yeah, it says so. Basically, everybody. Yeah, man. he's gonna cause. He's gonna force every. He's gonna give everybody a choice. Cause you gonna have to choose to you have to choose to, to to worship him, man. You know, just like during the time of Daniel, right there. You know, niggas would like to say that too, man. About what you know, you talking about? You know, uh, I says uh, Romans thirteen about the powers that be. You know, yeah, we gotta follow. We gotta follow this. We gotta follow the laws here. But it came up to a certain point, just like during the time of Daniel, which is where you like, all right, you got to step out there, like, all right, now, nah. you know, which that was worshiping uh, that, that image that uh, Nebuchadnezzar set up, man. Okay, and during this time, it's gonna be that MOTB, man. Right. See, it says, oh, and, and it's, it's physical, man. It's right. physical, man. Karakna, man. Look up that uh, word, Karakna. Exactly. Okay, and that no man might buy or sell, say that he had the mark or the name or the number or, uh, or the 
the name of the beast or the number of his name. Yeah, so you ain't gonna be able to so basically do anything in this new society, man, unless you got that that, that tag, man. Right. All right. Which is, a, and if you got that tag, you got the name. Right. If you got that tag, you got the number, man. Right. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna say uh, real quick, and uh, that that technology's been out there, man. They got it. They got it. You, you got your dog. You know, they got it on there. You know? Yeah. It's some some cities they, they require for your dog to have that. In Texas. Yeah, yep. te okay, in Texas. Oh, so you need to have that thing on there. Yep. Hey, but hey, but if they ever take it to the, you know, if your dog get lost, they take it to the vet. They scan it. It got all his information. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Got your name on there. You know. Yeah, the medical records, you know. See, that's why these banks are collapsing, man. It's all a trial run, bro. That's right. That's why these banks collapsing. They got the central, uh, the uh, CBDC, the central bank, digital currency, man. They, 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 they move, you, man. So this new system is it's already it's happening right before your eyes. Believe it or not, man. And it's going right in tandem with the scriptures. For those who don't believe that it's June, ain't no, it's no CHIP. It's right here in front of your face, man. Sure. They collapsing this shit right in front of us, bro. That's yeah. right. This is happening. It's a mock run. I don't think it's gonna happen like real fast, but they doing a trial run to see how the people gonna react. Man. Right. right. Yeah. yeah. And, and like the Khan said, it's gonna be a choice, man. And you gonna have you either gonna choose the Lord or you're gonna choose Esau. And that's why the very next uh, uh, chapter it goes into those that chose Esau is going to receive that brimstone and that, that, that mixture without fire. Man. And right. that's how you know you got the karate. Then exactly. you don't know you got it. Then your ass right. on fire. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Nigga, sure that's stupid, yeah. man. That's right. You're going to trick a numbers class. You can do math, but you can't comprehend the scriptures, man. Right. 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 You know, it's like the elder said, man. Esau's moving, man. Right. Okay. But guess what? How about should be outside moving too, man? Right. Right. See, it's always a balance to it, man. That's right. You know? So, hey, that Lord willing this lesson is edifying. We want to give all praises on that glory to your power. By Shem, Yahweh, by Shem, and Kakadash. Double honors unto the apostles of the great millstone and teaching rule will. Peace and blessings unto the elect. Shalom. Shalom.